Hey guys, <clears throat> welcome back to the channel. And I wanted to do another video on side loading apps as I think I maybe found a better way of doing it. Um, so yesterday I kind of talked about how to side load apps, but to make things easier, you can actually install um, apps from one of those, you know, some of those websites that offer APK files, you can actually download their app, which is kind of like an app store. So here I, as an example, I downloaded APK Pure and I use that to then install Microsoft Note. So it kind of speeds it up because now you don't have to rely on your computer. So let me just kind of do a quick demo here. So if we open up APK Pure, this is, I just got finished. So here you can actually now type in, so I tried Chrome, but it failed, but let's go ahead and try another app. So I'm looking at the comments here. I had a couple people make some requests. So one of the requests I got was uh, Notion. So let's see, N-O-T-I-O-N, oops, typo, Notion. I'm actually not familiar with the Notion app, so I'm hoping that this is it right here. There are two. I think it's this one, Notes and Tasks. So we're going to hit Install. And you kind of see it here. It's downloading it right now. It's not the fastest, but... We'll get there. Here we go. So, so far I only tried two apps. I tried Chrome and I tried OneNote. OneNote worked, but Chrome failed. Okay, we're going to hit install. That's it. So, it installed it. So now, let's go into our app drawer. There it is. And let's see if it works. Update Android system, web view to continue using Nord, Notion, I guess. Looks like we got an ad here. So Notion may, although it looks like it's installing something extra, so let's see if it works. Oh, it's installing Chrome, okay. Let's see. Nope, Chrome failed. Oh, it's trying to, so it needs Android system web view to work, is I think what it's trying to do. So let's see. I think the Google apps may not work because they're going to require some, it's probably looking for some Google folders that are just not here, but let's see. Come on, it's going slowly but surely. Well, let's see if it works. Nope. So no luck on this Notion app. I think Ruben, you were the one who asked for it. It looks like it requires some additional, yeah, it requires a web view with it, which it will not allow to install. So let's try something different. Let's go back to APK Pure and let's uh, search for another app.
Okay, so the other app he asked for was Medium. So let's see if we can find that one. What's going on? It looks like we gotta add. I guess that's the problem with this one is you, it comes with ads. I gotta figure out, oh, here it is. I gotta find the X to close out the ad, okay. Okay, so medium. Okay, so there is medium news and magazine. Let's hit install. Let's see if this one works. But this might be a, a you know, something that's worthy of installing. I mean, even if it only works half the time, it's still going to be much quicker than always going through the computer, especially if you're you know, out and about, not on a computer, near a computer, we can, this is almost like a app store, essentially. Okay, so that one says it worked, but let's open it. There we go. So it looks like medium does work. Um, I don't have an account, so can't really go any further than that, but it works. Let's try another one. So the other one was Substack. Let's see if we can make that one work. Substack right there. Let's see if it worked. Mm, oh, there we go. So Substack appears to work. Again, I don't have an account and that's something I use, so I can't go look any further. And then we'll do one more request before we wrap this up. So let's go back to here. And then the other one was the, looks like the BNN Nook reading app. I'm assuming that means uh, Barnes and Noble, but let's see if I can find that. Let's just look for Nook reading. Oh, there it is. Uh, Barnes and Noble Nook. I'm guessing this is the one he was talking about. Let's try it. Okay, it says it's done, so let's go into the... Ok, 
Okay, so that one may not work. Let's try that one again. Usually, oh wait, uh, looks like it does work, just took a little longer to load. But it appears to work, again, not an app I use, so I can't really confirm, but it seems to have loaded, so there you go. But yeah, so that's it for this video. The main thing I just wanted to really kind of highlight is uh, the ability to install the APK, um, APK Pure library app. And now you can kind of essentially have basically uh, like a Google Play Store here where you can get virtually almost all the apps and games and speed up the installation process. And yeah, so there you go. If you have any questions, let me know.